Welcome to our comparison video on lacrosse cleats versus soccer cleats. Both sports require a lot of agility and quick movement on the field. But do you need different types of cleats for each sport? In this video, we'll take a closer look at the features and benefits of each type of cleat to help you determine which one is right for you. So sit back, relax, and let's get started. Lacrosse cleats are designed to provide traction on both turf and grass surfaces. The cleats are typically longer and more spread out than soccer cleats, allowing for better grip on the field. They also have a mid-cut or high-top design, providing additional ankle support for lateral movements. Many lacrosse cleats also feature reinforced toes, protecting the feet from direct hits from sticks and balls. They are usually made from durable materials, such as leather or synthetic materials, ensuring long-lasting wear and tear resistance. Soccer cleats, on the other hand, are designed to provide traction on grass surfaces. They feature shorter and more compact cleats than lacrosse cleats, providing better maneuverability and quick turns on the field. They also have a low-cut design, allowing for more freedom of movement around the ankles. Soccer cleats are typically made from lightweight and breathable materials such as synthetic fibers, mesh, or leather. They may also have additional padding in the sole or around the heel to provide comfort during long periods of running. One of the significant benefits of lacrosse cleats is their versatility. They can be used on both turf and grass surfaces, making them ideal for players who may play on different fields. The mid-cut or high-top design also provides additional ankle support, helping to prevent ankle injuries from lateral movements. The reinforced toe feature also provides protection from direct hits from sticks and balls, preventing painful injuries on the field. Additionally, the durable materials used in lacrosse cleats ensure long-lasting wear and tear resistance, making them a cost-effective option for players who participate in the sport regularly. Soccer cleats offer a lightweight and breathable design, providing players with optimal comfort and ventilation during intense physical activity. The low-cut design also allows for greater freedom of movement around the ankles, providing players with more natural movement on the field. The shorter and more compact cleats on soccer cleats also provide better maneuverability and quick turns, which are essential for soccer players. They are also typically less expensive than lacrosse cleats, making them a more affordable option for players who are just starting with the sport. One potential drawback of lacrosse cleats is their lack of specialization. While they can be used on both turf and grass surfaces, they may not provide the best grip on either surface compared to specialized cleats. Additionally, the mid-cut or high-top design may limit some players' movements on the field, particularly those who prefer a low-cut design. One potential drawback of soccer cleats is their limited versatility. They are designed only for use on grass surfaces, making them unsuitable for use on turf or other surfaces. The shorter and more compact cleats may also provide less traction on wet or muddy fields, making them less effective in certain weather conditions. In conclusion, both lacrosse cleats and soccer cleats offer unique features and benefits that cater to the specific demands of each sport. Ultimately, the choice between lacrosse cleats and soccer cleats comes down to personal preference and the specific demands of the sport you are playing. If you are primarily playing lacrosse, then lacrosse cleats may be the better option due to their versatility and durability. However, if you are primarily playing soccer, then soccer cleats may be the better option due to their lightweight and breathable design, providing optimal comfort and ventilation during intense physical activity. We hope that this comparison has helped you better understand the differences between lacrosse cleats and soccer cleats and has provided you with the information needed to make an informed decision when choosing the right cleats for your sport. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more informative sports-related content.